coming up on Magnil today. We'll tell you about a deadline coming up. Plus, we will give you latest volleyball scores. Magnil today begins right now. From the McNeil Broadcasting Company, this is McNeil Today. Good morning and thanks for joining us. I'm Deja. And I'm Byron. Disney students have been deadline coming up this week. Your, your next payment is due this Friday, October 24th. An online payment information handout was sent out home on Monday. See Mrs. Brown, see Mrs. Borton if you have any questions. Homecoming week fun has begun and today is Sabotage the Eagles with your camouflage day. Tomorrow you will want to wear your best neon clothes. Remember anything not in neon theme must be in dress code. And looking ahead, Friday will be twin day. Find a friend and dress alike. The homecoming dance will be this Friday, October 24th from, 9 to, from, from 7 to 9 p.m. Admission is $5. Homecoming books will be for sale for $5. A photo booth will be available for $2. And the pink class shirts will be, will be $15 at the dance. Remember, students should be cleared of fines to attend. Any students that are absent or in ISS on Friday may not attend. Mums, are, mums and garters can be worn to the dance or game next Tuesday, but, but they are not allowed at school. There will be a hot dog feed this afternoon for all athletes participating on the McNeil team. The hot dog feed will be located out back near the gym entrance. The seventh grade Lady Mustangs took on Grand Monday night. The C team won in three, 25-22, 21-25, and 25-14. Offensive player of the game was Laurel Wiseman, and defense player of the game was Abigail Jones. The girls, the girls finished 5-0 on the season. The B team won in two, 25 to 16, and 25 to 18. Offense player of the game was Alexis Penrose, and defense player of the game was Melody Branter. B team finished 12 and 0 on the season. A team won in two, 25 to 17, and 25 to 18. Offense player of the game was Morgan Peace and Gabby Wilson. Defense player of the game was Brooke Franklin and Harley Coxon. A team finished 12 and 2 on the season. Great season, ladies, and your coaches, parents, and, and McNeil are very proud of you. The eighth grade volleyball teams also took on Grand Monday. The C team won 25 to 18 and 25 to 14. Offensive player of the day was Kelsey Kaiser. The defensive player was Lauren McAfee. The C team record is two wins and one loss. The B team won nine to 25, 25 to 14, and 25 to 17. The offensive player was Aspen Estevez. The defensive player was Sierra Melanson. The team's record is 5 and 2. The A team won 25 to 14 and 26 to 24. Offensive player of the day was Michaela Mays and the de defensive player was Trinity Watkins. The team ends the season with a record of 5 and 2. It's time for your weather. Here's Michael with your weather. Thanks guys. Let's take a look at the forecast. Today, mostly sunny with a high near 83 and a 20% chance of rain. Tonight, mostly clear with a low around 62. Thursday, partly cloudy with a high near 85. Thursday, mostly clear with a low around 60. Friday, mostly sunny with a high near 89. That's a look at your weather. Here's what is being served today in the main line of the cafeteria. Chicken nuggets, Italian sub, mixed vegetables, baked beans, praise crisp, praising crisp. Looking ahead, tomorrow will be turkey and rice or chicken and rice. We need your news and events. If any, if any of you have information on NBC today, here's, here are two easy ways to get it to us. You can email you can email it to us on cmjohnson at w, wfisd.net or drop it off to us here in room three, D138. Remember that we, we do need your information by 5 p.m. today before to ensure it will make, we'll make the show. That's what's going on around McNeil today. God, make it a great day. We'll see you tomorrow.